Hey everyone, it's Ariel, and we're back to another episode of Ariel and Tari Gaming, and we're back to my time at Sandrock, because they finally had the full release! Yes! So, I ended up stopping my playthrough back during the beta, because they were releasing a lot of new quests and things, and I had advanced so far that they were starting to cross kind of funky, so it seemed not really worth continuing to record at that time. But now the full release is out, so I figure let's jump in and get to experience the full game. Um, so this is what my builder is. I took some time to go ahead and customize it before recording. Uh, they got rid of the long hair I liked. There was a long hair with braids that like did the highlights really well, but it's gone. So I guess maybe they decided it didn't work very well. So anyway. This is what I've got. Let's just let's just jump right in. So first things we gotta pick our birthday. I usually just go summer 24 because that's just what I pick for my birthday. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Opening scene time. Let's see how much it's improved. I'm so excited to actually get to play the whole main story now. And if you guys don't know, the community is having some little challenges running. Um, they have a Discord. They have Twitter. So go check it out. There's some things going on with that. There's been a lot of DLC and everything that's dropped with the full release as well. Um, I was a backer in this game and I had I designed uh, one of the weapons in this game and I also have some art hidden in here somewhere. I have not seen the art. I have seen the weapon and I'm really stoked to get to it to show you guys. It probably won't be on this particular one because I think it's a little further into the story but I will get there but I'm excited to show it off and just get back into this game it's really great um, if you don't know they're the creators of my time at Porsche and they basically have like expanded and improved everything from that game they were really great at taking back all of us testers feedback and um, just improving so it's it's been really cool seeing it come along howdy <laughs> all right let's do hi it hi there you must be the new builder i'm Ian, the other new builder i just got here a week ago nice to meet you i'm here to take you to the commerce guild the retiring builder and the commissioner are there let's not keep them waiting follow me this all way. right so here we go and introduce our building life. Howdy there! I'm Yan, president of the San Rock Commerce Guild. Pleased to make your acquaintance, yada, yada, yada. I'll be overseeing you with me on, but don't think of me as your boss. Think of me more as, um, a buddy. That's your, uh... Uh, supervisor. That takes advantage this of you. This here's Mason. He's retiring, and you know, the whole reason for you being here and whatnot. But you knew that already. Uh, what am I talking about? See that workshop there on the other side of the tracks? It used to be Mason's, but now it's all yours. Ain't that swell? Just think of all the great stuff you'll be able to make in there for our Commerce Guild. And, well, for other people, too, I guess. Uh, well, I am now speechless. Uh, Mason, as the uh, established builder of Sandrock, why don't you say a couple of inspiring words? Um, well, let's not get too friendly. I mean, I'm on my way out of here. <clears throat> my workshop is yours now. You may find it run down and dilapidated, ill-equipped, <laughs> and... It is certainly those things, but you may also find that the place has a lot of heart. Mason looks like he's had some I refining. believe that will suffice. May you bring Telesis to the land. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm off to the blue moon. There are only so many more days I'll be able to get my Yakmel milk on. All right, give us our work job. Well, uh, he always was a bit awkward, mind you. Anyway, back to business. Before you start, I need to tell y'all a bit about how we work here in the desert. I know you already hold builder licenses, but things are a bit different here from what you're used to. To start with, there aren't too many trees around, so don't go swinging your axe around too much. It's, uh, frowned upon, anyway. 
but there's plenty of scrap metal and driftwood you can break apart. For that, you'll need something called a pick hammer. It's a pick with a hammer, just as the name implies. We use it only because it's useful for breaking up rocks, but it's also durable enough to break up the old world scrap all no. around here. So the pick hammer is basically our main tool. I look like I've been exposed to radiation. Kind of like it. to make as well. <laughs> you just need to find some stone, all right, all right, wood, all right. and yep, craft yep. it at your work table. Okay. And when you're done, just come find me in the Commerce Guild. But, all right. You know. Uh... So pick hammer. True. It is pretty easy to make. We should be able to find the stone and wood we need by just searching through junk piles on the ground. Hey, all right, so start let's out with junk piles. And see what kind of machines Mason left for you. Absolutely nothing. Let me take you there. I'm already getting pretty acquainted around here, so I can make sure you don't get lost. Thanks, Mion. At least you're nice. Ah, oh, remind myself of these. Hey, there are sandberries here now. Oh, it's not gonna let me do it. Okay. Never mind. Hold on. Wow, it's so perfect. Great. Hmm. Kind of slim pickings. But at least he did leave you a work table. That should be all you need to make a pick hammer. You know, Great. Sandrock is still well known across all free cities for being directly on top of an old world metropolis. They say some old scraps even end up here on the surface when the wind blows. Once we have our pick hammers, we can smash them up and get all the resources we need. Also, I kind of wanted to say something to you privately. What's up? Um, see... The reason I came to Sandrock is because it's not doing well for itself. Everybody in the Free Cities knows that. But I didn't hesitate signing that contract. Yeah, so our whole purpose basically is to bring Sandrock back I to thought life. thought it be the best way for me to make a difference in the world. We're gonna do I it. you feel the same way. We're gonna so build everything promise. and make builder it cool. Builder. Let's take Sandrock back to its glory days during our time here. Let's give it our all, okay? We got it! Well... I'm off to make my pick hammer. All right, pick hammer. Oh, uh, ooh, uh, how much bag space do I have? Not a lot. Ooh, so I'm going to have like uh, DLC things in my mailbox. All right, so this is your quest. It's just giving you your little tutorial. They really do a good job of highlighting everything and showing you how it works. Um, this is your social got tabs you got your friendships um, the, the interactions you could do each day um, it keeps track of what they like their social networks or like other people they're friends with that it'll affect um, and then now they they added this which is really cool um, so yeah so I don't know if they're well she's probably networked with Elsie oh but we haven't met her so it doesn't matter yep all right um yeah okay so let's see what we got here real quick got some free weapons and the box Let's get our super fan clothes. Oh, and then this is their little support letters. We're so grateful for your support and feedback. Show your appreciation. Yay! So some free furniture. Um, yeah, and so this, this was all from when they were working, still working on it. Hey, little Finnick boy! <laughs> Oh, it has a voice! Cha-cha! <laughs> I love it's the way it talks, because it'll be like, Cha-cha-cha-cha-cha-cha-cha! Alright, we're going to have it collect water, because water is very important. Alright, let's get to these junk piles, because we need some stone, and we need some wood. Oh, right, I have to wait. <laughs> I like that they added some sandberries over here. That's nice. Oh yeah, so everything gets added to your encyclopedia as you find it. Um, 
And the really fantastic thing about uh, your encyclopedia, oh yeah, if you hold tab, you can also do like a quick, quick save, which is pretty awesome. They added so many great things. So like in here, it shows you where they can be found and what you can find on them. Uh, okay, so I only have that one thing to look at. But so like it, it's found here and then it's like you can get do, you can get sandberries and all of this stuff. So sometimes if you're kind of like, Ugh, I don't know where to find this item, you can just click on it and it will tell you where you can find it. So it's very, very nice, very handy. If you ever are lost, it kind of guides you. Oh, Just wait, great. I've already got enough. Never mind. I don't even need to. Oh, hey, an axe. Nice. Okay, work table. Uh, yeah, so filter bar shows what you need, yada yada. Let's build it. Um, and there are ways to like refine and things like that later, but we don't we don't really need to worry about that right now. Uh, okay, so we have a pick hammer and an axe now, which is great. So we can go ahead and break up this scrap. That's on our thing. <coughs> There we go. How much does it cost to expand the first time? I don't even remember. A thousand. Alright. Yan. We made our pick hammer. Hey, Yan, I did now it. That's a nice looking pick hammer. Thank you. It is sir. the soul of a desert builder. Never lose it. <laughs> but if you do, well, now you know how to build another one, I suppose. Next, let me tell you about the recycler. It's another Very indispensable important. tool for a desert builder. It's the machine that's synonymous with, once yeah. it's made, you can put the scrap you collect with your pick hammer into the recycler to get all kinds of you. You can construct the recycler on your assembly station. Here's the diagram for it. Eh, okay. don't worry so much. All right, yeah. So the recycler is like one of the most important ones you need. So sometimes he'll have useful, um, what you call it, uh, diagrams. And I guess we can't do this yet. I don't think it'll let us, will it? Yeah, no, not yet. But there's a lot of different commissions in this, in Sandrock versus like Porsche, which is really cool. Um, Job, and you can kind of check things out. It's very cool, very cool. Added a lot of really neat details. Okay, so we need to build a recycler. We need grinding, grinding saws, stone troughs. So we need some stone. All right, so we got our first level up, which means we're gonna get a little perk. So then, yeah, this shows everything you need. Like these are required to make the saws and then you need wood and then this much stone makes the troughs. So we'll just click assemble. And then uh, we got the wood. We need to make another stone trough. So make one of these and we need more Dinus, so we have to go do some more quarrying. But we could pop down, uh, cycle. Okay, pop that crafted. Down. Throw those in there. And we made our first thing. Ooh, we got it at a perfect, too. Very nice. That was lucky. Alright, let's plop down our recycler. Boop. And. We've got a little bit of scrap we could throw in there. Throw our dregs in there. I can't do two, huh? all right. All right, so now that's running. Cool beans. Oh yeah, and then these tumbleweeds that you'll see flying around, you can jump on them or hit them, whichever you want to do and they'll break apart and give you resources so that's another way to get okay resources. time to go talk to yan again because we got our recycler going hey yan hey 
Hey, there you are. <laughs> no, no need to show me the recycler. I'm sure it's fine. You have a builder's license, right? Besides, what's the worst it could do? <laughs> Explode and burn our whole town to the ground? <laughs> the main yeah, thing to take away right. here is that from now on, whenever you have questions, you can just consult your workshop <laughs> handbook. The and point is, don't ask me anything ask me ever. Anything related to <laughs> so, okay. now you have the basic knowledge of a desert builder. Awesome. Why don't you mosey on over to City Hall? Normally, okay, the mayor so handles Hall. registrations. Right, where well, is you here? hadn't heard? She's off trying to plant things in the Ufala desert. <laughs> Didn't no one ever tell her plants need dirt to grow? Oh, uh, by the way, I found a couple of extra diagrams oh, I was probably going to throw away. <laughs> uh, 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 but uh, why would I do that when I could just uh, recycle them uh, to you? <laughs> Play. Uh, no need to thank me. Consider it a new employee. Okay. Anyway, hurry over to City Hall and have Matilda register your workshop. While you're out, I'll be preparing a job for you. Sweet. All right, so we got some diagrams. He probably gave us the furnace, I imagine. Met a couple more people. Got some more plants in our thing. So now we know where those are and what Thank they you. are. Hi, Captain Meow. Yeah. Meow. <laughs> this Meow-Kiado. meow, -kiado. meow -kiado. Here's Heidi. Oh, right. Oh, who goes there? Oh, yeah. introducing. Oh, it's you. <laughs> I thought you were one of Logan's gang. Hi, Pen. <laughs> Silly me. You look nothing like an outlaw. That's bold of you to assume, sir. And your arms <laughs> are so skinny. Do you even know how to defend yourself? <laughs> you know the desert isn't kind to the fragile. Well, thanks for the consideration. Mm. It is decided. This is decided. The magnificent <laughs> pen, the protector of Sandrock, as of five seconds ago, <laughs> have taken it upon myself to offer you a combat lesson. All right, so combat tutorial. Let's Splendid. do it. It's a fun little bout either way. You know why I came all the way out here to <laughs> serve and protect? Oh, so because beautiful. Because this place builds toughness. Toughness. If you ain't tough, the desert will chew you up and spit you out. Okay. People here need to train often to build that toughness. Now, before we spar, you I can go pick a weapon exposure. from over there. It doesn't matter which. All the same to me. Okay. Well, I am going to pick the sword and shield because the weapon I designed is sword and shield. So <laughs> this is what I'm going to be using. Come, come and attack me. I won't fight back. Let me see what you can do. All right, here I come. Wow, boom. Is that Bang. all you've got? Yeah. Don't tell me you skip leg day. It's, this would be arm okay, day, sir. You can swing a weapon around. <laughs> We're all very proud of you. But can you break through my defense? I just did, sir. <laughs> did I just feel pain? <laughs> I don't know. Did you? You tell me. <laughs> don't you know any other moves? I'm getting bored. Take that chance to go for a combo. Now it's my turn. Oh, he's attacking. No. Hoya. Still, this won't hurt much. Oh, don't hurt me. He's supposed to be stunned. I can read you like a book, skinny arms. Oh! Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Whoa. All right, endurance. <laughs> okay, now he's going to beat our butt. I grow weary of this. I grow weary. Time to end this. You broke the arena. And thus concludes the segment of my combat course title, <laughs> Never Mess with, with pen. pen. I hope you learned something. <laughs> I sure had fun teaching it. Thanks. The first thing I would do if I were you is to go back to your work table and craft a weapon. But that's just me. I have a weapon. Farewell, I'm just not high enough arms. level to use it. Thanks, sir. So, building, huh? <laughs> Digging around in the dirt. Oh, that gave me a nice little relationship bo boost. Taking orders from everyone in town. Sounds super. super. 
Thanks, Farewell. Ken. Uh, let's see. Can I go ahead and put an ad? Uh, do, do, can I do this? Logan, still at large. Vocational vacancy vacated. In case you forgot, it's almost the day of memories. Uh, please add? I don't have enough. I think I have a chance to subscribe later. Uh, I already met you. Okay, let's go talk to Matilda. Matilda! I need to name my workshop. Uh, well, hello. Hi, how's it going? Why, hello there. You must be the builder. I'm That's Mr. Me. Matilda from the Church of Light, filling in for Mayor Trudy. We're so excited to see you getting started as a builder here in Sandrock. Well, thank you, ma'am. If you're here, well, that means you must have passed Yen's little audition and you're ready to register your workshop. All you have to do is fill in the name of your... Okay. So, we'll just go with yellow. Go. That'll do it. If you ever want to change your workshop name again, you can buy a rename card from the City Hall store. Okay. Congratulations, Builder. Your workshop is officially open for business in Sandrock. Whenever you're ready, you can yes. start taking commissions from the commission. Now, Time to I'm not money. exactly known around these parts for my arithmetic, but I do reckon we can expect a lot from two builders as opposed to just old Mason by his lonesome. Work hard. Then you'll have plenty of pocket money for your. Mm. All right, thanks, ma'am. I dare ma say this calls for a celebration. A celebration. Mm, we have fireside meetings on Sunday nights. All right. But I reckon I'll just round everyone up tomorrow to proper welcome you new builders. Oh, and you must come. It wouldn't be. See you then. And congratulations again, builder. Okay. Yeah. So everybody's really focused on the whole like bring Telesis to Sandrock because they're really trying to rebuild. Sandrock. This is from Gail and Liza, which Gail is the mayor from my time at Portia, if you do not know. So it's very cool. And then this Martel's knapsack, which Martel was the original founder of Sand Sandrock. So they like they added a lot of little things. Oh Miguel, you having a little glide around? You enjoying no your slide? No need for introductions. I know who you are. I'm Pastor Miguel. I guess you could say I'm the brains behind this little operation. Good to know. I trust you'll bring Telesis to Sandrock and beyond. Thanks, sir. I always take I'll try note of my best. Goodbye. Goodbye. All right. Where's my chest? Ha ha. Free stuff. I'm going to have to chop it up. First day on the job. Ooh, water. That is super valuable. Thank you. Bye. All right. Restoration. Learn about... I, I can't. I don't have data discs. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. They even have this cool little thing about how Sandrock was found. And it looks like they expanded on it, too, which is very cool. Yes, they added more rewards. Oh, sweet. Great. I love filling the museum. I, I think everyone who played my type of Porsche loved filling the museum. All right, back to the Carver's Guild again. Oh, hey, did you get a message from Yen saying emergency <coughs> come now as well? Under what's the emergency? Listen here, you lazy mop stick. Me and my boys have had it up to here with your excuses. Where's our lift, huh? Oh, look, Rocky, old buddy, old pal. Don't you buddy me, pal. <laughs> Since Mason's leaving, you promised me you'd do it yourself. First it was you had a cold, and then it was your turtle beans. And today I find out you don't even got a turtle. Do you understand how much money I'm losing here? So now I got to give you a beat down. Sorry, pal. <laughs> But it's a company policy. Oh, uh, uh, wait, no, Rocky. Uh, look, well, what I really meant is uh, I was bringing in new people to take special care of your commission. Uh, uh, look, here they are. 
Did we come at a bad time? No, no! You came at the perfect time! Uh, Mr. Rocky here is the big boss of Eufala Salvage. And he's got a very special commission that we should take care of right away. All With right. Mason's departure, the commission sort of got lost in the shuffle for a few <clears throat> uh, months or so. <laughs> but now that you two are both registered workshops, you can take this commission off my hands. <clears throat> uh, help out, uh, right? Oh, yeah, sure. That's what we're here for. Did you hear that? Our first big job! Great! See? They're up for it! Uh, what do you say, uh, buddy pal? Alright, Yen. Against my better judgment, <laughs> I'm gonna give you one more chance. But Great. he still deserves Listen here, one builders. punch. <laughs> Rocky and his miners are working out of Paradise Lost. You know, that big-looking ruins right next to the builder's workshop? Yes, my pal here commissioned two crane ton. lifts to move things up and down this real long tunnel they're working out of. And since there are two of you... Right, sorry so. for putting you two on the spot. If only Yan's doing his job like he's supposed to, and... Hey, I'm not your pal. <laughs> if you're looking for parts, we have a bunch of salvage in our company backyard that you can Yay. rumble through. It's located by the Paradise Lost Ruins. Lots of miners there. Can't miss it. Normally, we charge a weekly fee for access. Yay. But here, take a free one-week pass. When you're done, install it for me as well. G already drew me up a diagram for the lift. So yeah, you can have it. Hope you put it to better use than this sorry excuse for a builder here. Uh, my, uh, back was hurting. Alright, first Based mission. Based on this diagram, we won't be able to find these parts from any random scrap. I guess we'll need to take a look at Rocky's salvage yard. Looks like we'll need to use the furnace as well. Well, we can't finish if we don't get started. Let's do our best. Alright, so furnace and mm -hmm. more See ya. things. Oh, it's you. Say, since I've got you, did I ever explain the, uh... All right. Uh, all right, then, Noop. The most important commissions that I'll need you to do... Well, don't you worry about it. But for everything right, else, yeah. there's the commission board so inside quest the guild. Main commissions are separate from Townsfolk post less commissions. urgent commissions there. Nevertheless, the you should board, still... Each get commission things, gets get a money. star rating. One star means it's easy. Five stars means it's for pros only. Want to feel... Since you're a newbie, bottom. you can only take one per day. No. Finish it up quick, then pick up a new commission the next day. At the end of the year, we here at the guild count up who's been doing what around town and divvy out awards to the top performers. The rewards for taking first... Pl uh, but I wouldn't concern yourself with that so much. I mean, I've never lost. <laughs> well, that about does it. Got it? That's yep. good, newbie. You listen to speech as well. Okay. So we're, yeah, we start at the bottom and we can get lots of money. We can get for the monthly, we get the commerce badges and water, which water is always nice. There we go. Now there's a bunch of stuff. Wow, you, you get the baby crib right off the bat. Uh, so thick rope, we're going to need that. Um... I mean, a lot of these things we're gonna need, but I'm pretty poor right now. Alright, so I'm out of stamina on the first day. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this episode up right here. Um, going forward, I'm probably gonna do a lot of shortening, a lot of cutting out of non-essential things. Um, but there are a lot of a lot of scenes, a lot of uh, like personal quests with the NPCs and stuff like that. So I don't want I don't want to skip over all of that. Um, but I'm going to try and keep it kind of concise because it can get pretty lengthy. But we're going to wrap it up here and then we'll start off again tomorrow and start working on some of our real commissions. So if you enjoyed, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. See ya!